surprise, my balayage client turns out to be a color correction. So what we got to do first is go out and bleach out the zone two there, all those bands. I started with 15 volume blonde me on her back quadrant and on my front right quadrant here I have bumped up my developer to 30 volume and as you can see I'm just feathering slightly onto her old previous lightened hair. It's been about half an hour now and I'm just going in and just seeing where my lightener is sitting at and it is doing great so what I'm going to do now is go in with 15 volume and apply it to her root. Okay, so we left it on for an hour and now we're going to go in and reapply those bands with 20 volume blonde me and then we'll just let it sit until we feel like it is ready to rinse. Now it's my favorite part. We've let her lightener process for a total of one and a half hours and now we are going in to apply her little mini shadow root using more vibrance. I love using more vibrance to do my shadow roots because it's a demi color, which means it's going to fade within a couple washes. What I'm applying on her, her root right now is 7, 1, 8, 0, and 9, 0 with 6. Now my client wants to be a nice bright blonde, not too yellow and not too gray. So that California buttery blonde and uh, so we added nine and a half dash one and to get the best result it's best to wait the full processing time i'm going to leave her on for about 15 to 20 minutes before i take her down at the sink and boom just like that look at her after hair it is amazing